Here we are with Master Adrian Bay from ITF Ireland. Hello, Master. Tell us a little bit about the coaches' conference that we are having here at Limerick. So, hey, Luciano. Yeah, this weekend we're running the ITF International Coaches Conference for the second time here in Limerick. It's really a fantastic community event for the coaches and instructors from all around Europe and the world to come together, learn, discuss, share and enjoy their ITF Taekwondo with us. We try to bring people together and give them a theme to shape their conversations. So this year we're really focused on the development of the child athlete, so the pre-adolescent. And we're looking at things like how do we acquire skill? Uh, how do we develop flexibility? How do we teach them jumping and landing? Uh, how does the coaching of patterns, uh, the coaching of sparring, you know, how do we engage them really in their, in their learning? And so what we try to do with the conference is to make sure that the coaches have really a lot of time to practice their coaching under the guidance of some of our, you know, our well-known Taekwondo experts, but also some people from outside of the world of Taekwondo who have a lot of expertise in these areas and give them things to talk about, something to share over a coffee, over lunch, uh, and to keep the conversation going. And that way, at the end, I think everybody has a little bit better understanding and appreciation of their take one. Is it very important that you put this word, um, share, because there are coaches from all over the world, maybe what is working in some place may not work in, in another, or maybe we can have suggestions or ideas and put us in, in, in work in our dojans, right? Yeah, but that, so culture is different from place to place, but people are people. And so we can pick up ideas from another culture, another country, another coach that they have been using for some time and that worked for them. Maybe it just never came across to where we're training. And if someone has a good idea, it would be such a shame if in this day of the internet, Uh, and you know worldwide sharing that the idea doesn't make its way out to the other coaches to use it so we really want to bring everyone together to give them the opportunity to share what they know and to question and you know challenge and find new ways even just to explore what could be perfect we know that this is complementary in Ireland here in Ireland and in Europe do you think it uh, what about the possibility of bringing this course to another parts of the world just South America North America Oceania Yeah, of course it's possible because again, like I said earlier, people are people but the culture is different. So certainly we can bring this type of training to other parts of the world. Uh, for us, the most important thing was to start. And it's easiest for us to start close to home where the, uh, where the trainers of the course live. But it will certainly be possible to bring this course around the world and to do it for people elsewhere. It may also be possible within the European context to have people travel once again and do something similar. But to do it, we think, in Argentina or in North America or in Oceania, we may also employ people from the uh, International Council for Coaching Excellence who maybe live more locally or speak the language more natively. And so we have that option as well. What are the next steps from ITF Coaches Committee? Okay, so there are some projects that we really wanted to finish before we move on to other things. This coaches conference was one of them. And running it here was just almost like a second pilot so that people could understand what it is, what we want it to be like, and see value in it for uh, later use. We would love to see this conference happening in other parts of the world, maybe as much as twice per year, you know, in different parts of the world, so people can come together more easily and more affordably to share their thoughts and ideas. And everyone can be a little bit different because we can have a different theme for every conference. For the coach developers, they will be working very hard over the next year to finish their qualification, to deliver projects, uh, courses, uh, and to support other coaches in their work. And we would hope to be able to train a wider cohort of those as well. But from the ITF Coaches Committee, we want to develop resources that those people can use in their countries, owned by the national associations and delivered through coach developers and other people who are qualified to help coaches in those countries. So we need to develop courses, workshops, information, leaflets, that kind of thing. So we're going to be starting at that very, very soon.